What's going on guys? Welcome back to Limitless Racing again. So today I just got a little short video for you guys on how to fix a problem with the EBCM on the C5 Corvettes. So I come out to my car, I go ahead and I try to start it up, and I get this. Tracks, uh, service traction system, tire pressure, that's always there, service ABS. When I pull up the code, I get this guy, the C1255. Now with that code, with that being on, that turns traction control off all the way except for it's called brake torque management which means you can't do a standing burnout you put the foot on the brake and the gas it won't let you spin the tires it shuts the throttle body on you i'll show you what it does my main problem is when i'm going to get on the brake and the two-step and all while i'm going to launch my car you hear it it'll start bouncing duh, 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 and then it'll just cut the throttle body back and you just hear it go Burr, and it leaves horribly so i'll show you what it does uh, so with the car in gear, hold the button down, and you'll hear it. Watch my RPMs. My two-step set at 2,800. Drops it down to about 2,000. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run home. I'm going to grab my computer. I'm gonna show you how to tune that out. It's not in the tune, like on the 2002 Plus, they actually have a brake, uh, brake torque management option that you can adjust. For mine, the 2000s, the P01 ECUs, they do not have that option. But there is a little backdoor option that you can do that will cancel it out completely so your ECU doesn't even think it has that option on it. So let's run back to my house real quick and let's go grab it. All right, so we got the computer hooked up. Usually for the brake torque management, you would do that underneath the trans section. And I believe it's in torque management. It would pop up in there. And there'd be a whole nother section down here. I know also in the engine, there's the torque management as well. And it might be somewhere in the abuse or engine or general, I can't remember. To get around this, you should go up here to systems. First, you gotta make sure you are in view mode and make sure you're in advanced. Basic, you won't be able to see it. So you go to systems, go over here to system options. It's not focusing. You also wanna look right here where it says platform type. Mine is Y. So you come down to the table and you see where the Y is. And you see it's one for if it's equipped with it and zero if it's not. So like I don't have a trans hot switch, it's zeroed out. Over here, you see brake torque, torque, man brake torque management. You're gonna change that to a zero. Come back. And you'll see that it is highlighted red, showing that there's a change now. And all you gotta do is write it. When you go to write it, instead of just doing a ca uh, right calibrations, you have to do a right entire. Now, on here, it will pop up saying this is brickable. It's pretty much warning you, like, writing the entire code, if something interrupts it, computer dies, or anything like that, you can brick your ECU. I know several people who have done full writes, and they have not messed up their ECU, hasn't bricked it or anything. So we're going to go ahead and write this to the ECU, and see if that works. Alright, so we are done loading the tune on. We got everything loaded up in here. Let's go ahead and test it out now. I'm so nervous. It works. Oh, thank you, God. You guys don't understand. I have been fighting with this problem for at least a month now, ever since this went out. I could not figure it out to save my life. I took all the torque management out, everything I could, and I could not figure it out. Finally, today, I was just looking into it again after like a weekend of not doing it because I went on vacation. And instead of 
typed in Corvette or C5 Corvette, 2000 Corvette, I typed in the ECU. I did P01 HP tuners, brake torque management, and it was one of the first five that popped up. And the dude said, go through, delete it out of the system options, and it actually worked. So finally, I can get a race now and let my car leave instead of bogging. All right, well, hopefully, if one of you guys are having the same problem as me and you can't figure it out and you have the traction control issue, the code off uh, C1255 saying that your EBCM is bad and you just want to go out and do burnouts or race like me, then at least this video can help you and you can figure out how to get rid of that brake torque management. It will save you a ton of effort. Yeah, Trey couldn't be with us today, so doing it through FaceTime with him today. <laughs> I know, I finally fixed it. It didn't break my ECU. Yeah. And now I gotta hold both hands so I gotta turn. <laughs> uh, I got Snapchat. Uh, Alright, guys, well, that's it for today. Hopefully I can save you guys a lot of time trying to figure this out and now you can go out racing and doing burnouts and all. And like and subscribe. <laughs> exactly. Say it again for him, Trey. Say it again. Like and subscribe. You heard him, folks. All right, guys. Peace. We actually have a cool little video coming up for you guys soon of another upgrade we did to the Corvette or doing to the Corvette. But due to this whole COVID and this coronavirus, I'm waiting on some parts to come in so I can finish it up. I got half of it on, don't have the other half because of two little things. So make sure you come back when that video is posted. Well, alright guys, until next time, see you later.